Hey, hey students, here is our second part of Bone Crusher. So we've just come out of half of the C section and finished on this power chord at fret 7 on the fat string. We're then going to move down to the next string and maintain our power chord shape for most of this section. So you'll see in bar 13, which is the last bar on page 1, we're going to go still maintaining that power chord shape and also with these lines try and make sure you're dancing off the string after you pick the note you don't want the notes to hang around when you pick them like this it'll be best if you can make it by just releasing the pressure in the left hand on the fingertips okay so that last bar, 13, then a quick strike of fret 9 again with our ring finger, and then we're sliding into fret 10, and then quickly going back to fret 8. Okay, so from the last bar on the first page to the first bar on the second page, we have this. Mm -hmm. Maybe just worth giving that a little practice. The next part of the line, we're going to hit 8 twice more, but then we're going to slide up to 10 and land on it. Nice hard beat 4. Like that. So those two bars in sequence. Then back to fret 7 for two quick picks and then middle finger on the same string to fret 8 and then quickly back to 7 that line again then we're going to slide back to 5 after a quick pick of this 7 once more on the end of beat 4 again like we did with the power chords but this time a single note to another single note. So this is now going to go one, two, three, four, and one. Okay? So if you can see that there, at the end of bar 15, there's a quick seven to the five on the end of beat four. Bar 15, one, two, three, four. Take note of the fingers we have to use. Or well, don't have to, but they make things a bit smoother when you use the fingers that are above the frets. We're going to go 7 to 5. Use middle finger or second finger to go to fret 6 on the fat string. First finger for fret 5. And then move down to fret 3. Okay? So, I'll play the whole C section this time from the beginning going through the transitions and take note of the power chord shapes and then when we're using this backward shape C section C section that you need to practice. That has a lot of tricky single lines in it and some good power chords. Okay, the last section, the E section of Bone Crusher, is a lead line and it repeats twice. So we're going to put our first finger on fret 5 so we can reach all of these frets. If you have long enough fingers, you might want to bring your thumb up a bit to get more of an angle across the fretboard and use stronger fingers like this. But if you can, try and get more of a flat shaped hand and reach and get that pinky in the action. 
Okay, so here's the first line of the E section. Okay, and if you look at your music, you'll see a little line that connects the two same notes. That is a tie. When you connect two of the same notes, it's called a tie. When you connect two different notes, it's called a slur. Okay. And you can see the gap. And then the next three notes. Another little space. And then another space. So let's put those two bars together. One, two, three, four. Okay, now you can do all down picking if you like, but see if you can play a few of those lines alternate picking. So your pick goes down, up, down, up, like this. And remember, I'm exaggerating my movements a little bit, but try and keep your pick and your hand nice and close to the strings. Okay, now the last two lines, almost the same. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try those last two lines again. This time, I'm going to change my hand position and reach across like this, just so you can see a different way to play it. Last two bars, one, two, three, four. Okay, and those last two notes fall on beat three and four, but they are short and stabby. So hit the five, and then rest your pick on the string again. Another way to do it is by releasing the pressure after you've picked the note. But I find it more effective if you can land the pick on the string in your right hand. All right, let's play the whole E section. One, two, three, four. 